How does the CPC prevent corruption? The answer is painstaking self-reform. China has two anti-corruption bodies, the Central Commission for Discipline Inspection, CCDI, the party's disciplinary arm, and the National Supervisory Commission, the National Anti-Corruption Agency. To strengthen political discipline and rules, the eight-point decision on improving party and government conduct was carried out. Since the party's 18th National Congress in 2012 to June of this year, disciplinary and supervising agencies have investigated a total of 4.5 million cases and have brought 4.4 million offenders to justice. Both senior and grassroots officials, or big tigers and small flies, are punished with many of them receiving custodial sentences. This ensures that officials do not dare, are not able, and have no desire to commit acts of corruption. It's written in the report to the 20th CPC National Congress that the CPC must always stay alert and determined to tackle the special challenges that a large party like the CPC faces in order to maintain the people's support and consolidate its position as a long-term governing body.